When we look at this problem, our eyes naturally focus on the fraction 2 over 3 and the number 15 at the end. We see that 3 is in the denominator and 15 is a multiple of 3. It feels intuitive to simplify this first. 3 divides into 15 exactly 5 times. So we take the numerator 2 and multiply it by 5, which gives us 10. And again here we have a 10 at the start. So we take 10 divided by 10, which equals 1. It looks like a perfect solution. But this answer is not correct because according to the order of operations, we cannot simply cancel numbers across an expression just because they look compatible. There is a strict sequence we must follow. Before we break down the correct method, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel for more viral math explanations. Also, I have a quick test for you. What is 20 divided by half times 10? Is it 1 or is it 400? Let me know your answer in the comments below to be the pinned comment for this video. Now, back to the problem. The rule says, first we have to do parenthesis, then exponents, then multiplication or division, and finally addition or subtraction. Remember that multiplication and division have equal priority and we have to work from left to right. In this expression, we have a division involving a fraction followed by a multiplication. The trap is assuming the multiplication belongs to the fraction, but it does not. We must solve the operations in the order they appear from left to right. The first operation is 10 divided by the fraction 2 thirds. We cannot touch the 15 yet. To divide by a fraction, we use the rule keep, change, flip. We keep the 10, change division to multiplication and flip 2 over 3 to become 3 over 2. So 10 times 3 is 30 and 30 divided by 2 is 15. Now, we bring down the final part. We are left with 15 multiplied by 15. If we had cancelled earlier, it would be wrong. We simply calculate the final product. And this is our final answer to this problem. The correct answer is 225.